AI is moving exponentially and it feels like the speed of light. We got so much to talk about and it feels like we have so little time. Uh, I just want to say before we get started, if anybody is interested in learning more about your new project, Zarka, they can go to LondonReel.tv forward slash Zarka, that's Z-A-R-Q-A, to request some more information. We will be investing in Zarka through London Real Ventures. And like I said, anyone can go to LondonReel.tv forward slash Zarka to learn more. Let's jump into it. Four months ago, OpenAI's ChatGPT launched, and because of it, I would say, the world now finally understands the game-changing power of AI. You've been in this field for many, many years. What do you make of this ChatGPT moment? As far as, in your mind, Janet, what is it, and also, what is it not? It's a catalytic moment where humanity is starting to realize the power of artificial intelligence. We've had AI hype cycles for decades. There's been a huge amount of promise. When I first started studying artificial intelligence in 2017, I was working full time in banking at the time. And there was, a, there was a major hype going on on the back of some great breakthroughs on Siri, some DNNs, deep neural networks, technologies really taking AI forwards. And at that time, we thought in financial services that by 2023, AI would be running a huge amount of the industry. But actually, that promise has not fulfilled itself. And that's due to a number of different uh, reasons. Data sets is due to regulatory um, constraints. It's due to education because AI is quite hard technology. It's, it's quite difficult maths to understand. And in large organizations and in government bodies and in regulators, that level of understanding isn't really there in order to be able to adopt and use AI at scale. And then fast forward to January 2023 when uh, OpenAI released ChatGPT, suddenly here is a working technology that in some cases and for some questions can approximate a human level single intelligence on a single question, right? It can answer really smartly. It can, it can simulate, and it does simulate, huge volumes of data from across the internet, runs statistical methods on it to be able to predict, like a memory model, to be able to predict what would come next. GPT-4 went multimodal, so it now includes images as well. And generally, I was speaking with one of the large consultancies last week, there's a held belief that ChatGPT can bring an 8% or so productivity improvement to industry and to businesses. And what business wouldn't want that? Brian, you and I both have a passion for SMEs, particularly UK SMEs and, and small medium enterprises who are out there um, working hard every day to put food on, on their children's tables. 8% productivity for a technology that's relatively easy to use. That's a huge boost to the economy. It's a, it's a huge gift, really, to businesses and industries. So it's a, it's a watershed moment for humanity. It's the realization that AI can be, can be used, can be harnessed and utilized in tools that ordinary people can use, that hotel cashiers can use, that receptionists can use, that any kind of marketers that can use, that any call center can use, any sales, online sales um, channels can use. It, it, it's, its uses are very, very widespread. However, <laughs> there is, to, to your point, what is it also not? Whilst being in some ways incredibly clever, and I do pay homage to the great scientists who have worked with these giant, large neural networks in order to create the technologies like, like, like ChatGPT. As well as being in some ways phenomenally clever in that they can take huge amounts of data, they can replicate what that data might say or do or create. They have no actual creative powers. They have no reasoning capability. They have no, no knowledge. Their reproduction, their output, is simply based on pattern recognition from the past. And if those patterns aren't accurate, because it has no knowledge grounding, then it doesn't know it's not accurate. So it can spout random bullshit. And 
the reader may not be aware that it's spouting inaccurate facts. It certainly is not aware. It has zero self-awareness. So as a tool for humanity, its usefulness is highly constrained by its random error rate, I guess, and its inability to know when it's making errors. And then if you think we're both as well, we've both worked in financial services industries, right? The, the past is not exactly a guide to the future. The future, and this is one of the things which is so special about humans, we're continuously evolving socially and we're continuously creating new, new thought patterns, new ways of being, new philosophies, new, new inventions. A chat GPT cannot do that. A chat GPT or any of the large language models, large memory models, large image models, whatever you want to call them, they cannot evolve and create new outcomes for humanity. They're stuck in the past. And who wants to be stuck in the past when we're at the brink of the greatest breakthrough in the whole history of our species into greater new artificial intelligent, artificial general intelligent beings that can dramatically transform what it means to be human. So Jim Rickards has just recorded a video that's not available to anyone in the public and he's going to be talking about how this upcoming recession is going to be fast, it's going to be bloody, it's going to be nasty. But at the same time, he's going to show you how you can position yourself to profit from all of this chaos. Now we've made this video only available to our viewers. Go to LondonReal.tv forward slash Jim. Watch that immediately. I can't say enough good things about Jim Rickards. He understands the global economic system better than any guest I've ever had on London Real. His predictions are almost uncannily true and you can learn how to profit from his vision, from his expertise, and his understanding of economics. So go to LondonReal.tv forward slash Jim or click the link below. It's an excellent, excellent look on what's gonna happen in the future and how you can position yourself to profit from that. Jim is one of the best in the business, one of my favorite guests on London Real, and he's very, very good at predicting the future and showing us all to profit from it. So click the link and I hope you enjoy. Hey, do you wanna profit from crypto? Then join my DeFi Academy. The Crypto DeFi Academy will help you create generational wealth. But don't take my word for it, listen to my students. When I first got into crypto, I remember thinking to myself, I need to learn more. Brian Rose, learning crypto, learning DeFi, gotta do it. I am so grateful that I jumped in and did this. I had to break through some limiting beliefs that I can do this, that I can afford this, that I can be in this. It challenges um, the things that are deeply rooted within us. Joining DeFi Academy has been one of the best decisions I have made on my blockchain journey. This course was a life changer, a game changer, a huge eye opener. Coming from knowing practically nothing at the speed of the learning over the over four weeks was just fantastic. The information you provided in this class was invaluable. I feel far more confident in my next steps. You took complex concepts and made them easier to understand. What's different than so many other ones is it just doesn't tell you what to do. It uh, actually makes you do it. This is for people who are serious about becoming traders. This is the way it should be done. I realized from this learning experience again that it is not about what you learn, but about who you learn it from. The energy was insane. I've, I've never experienced such incredible energy on a live call. Brian Rose, you, you are a legend, my friend. It's the only thing in the market where you can get all information and learn everything what you need to know. Everything is so clear and so well done. And I am um, just forever grateful for this program. It made me feel so much more confident about crypto than I did before. I did not anticipate how passionate I was going to become about it. It's course has been like a big learning experience for me, not just in the crypto space, but just uh, an overall uh, balance of life. What I've learned is, you know, how to take ownership, you know, of my life in a way that um, I really, I really hadn't before. Yeah, you can't put a price on that, really. I would recommend it to anybody top notch. Excellence does not come cheap. You know, so if you want excellence, you gotta pay for it, but it's so worth it. 
pull the trigger. That's what this course is about. You're not going to regret it, really. It's amazing. Thank you, Brian and team. So what are you waiting for? Crypto is happening now. Click the link below, submit your application, and let me mentor you on how to create generational wealth and build the decentralized financial infrastructure of the future.